The government of the Bahamas sealing another partnership with the People's Republic of China. This one to restore sight to hundreds. Ladon Davis has all the details in this next report. I have the privilege to announce the launch of the Brightness Action, a pioneering initiative aimed at addressing vision impairment caused by cataracts in the Commonwealth of the Bahamas. It's a launch that will bring no doubt brighter days and good vision for that matter for the 200 patients expected to receive a life-changing cataract surgery, an undertaking facilitated by the Chinese government during the first phase of the Brightness Action Initiative. Minister of Health and Wellness Dr. the Honorable Michael Darvo revealing that some 742 cataract patients are awaiting the free surgery. The PHA and the Ministry of Health has launched our cataract program by way of Cuba. And we are seeing up to 50 patients per week to address that backlog. The People's Republic of China, uh, South Central University, and Wuhan Province have also joined in. Uh, that will be coming on stream very shortly. And I'm pleased to report that we are working with a philanthropic group out of California who will come to the Bahamas to address some of the complicated glaucoma cases that exist in the Commonwealth of the Bahamas. Darville says a dedicated team of PMH ophthalmologists will lead the initiative by providing the vital surgery intervention needed to restore the eyesight of patients. Cataracts and glaucoma are the leading cause of vision loss in the Bahamas, affecting individuals of all walks of life. Brightness Action builds on the success of past programs, such as the partnership with the Chinese government National Health and Family Planning Commission in 2014 and 15, and the previous collaboration to enhance ophthalmic services to bring lasting relief and improvement to countless Bahamians across the archipelago. His Excellency Mao Waiming, Deputy Secretary of the Hunan's People's Republic of China, is proud to be able to not only partner with the Bahamas, but to provide equipment and facilities to give the gift of sight. I'm very happy to be here to introduce you the Central South University. Central South University, the unit that has undertaken the task of brightness action this time, is one of the first batch of the double first-rate universities in China. And the Xiangya Hospital, which is affiliated to this university, is a well-renowned hospital in China. We tend to say that the best hospital in the north of China is Xiehe Hospital. Now, the first surgery for cataract patients still on the waiting list is expected to take place sometime in June. For the Bahamas Tonight, I'm LaDawn Davis. Hello, everyone. I'm Fern Carey. Thank you for watching our YouTube page. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe for all things said and asked.